All right. So it actually turns out that Pig Maker 2.0 actually went live while I was doing my videos. But you know, I waited till after I exercised a little bit, let the market action on this stuff, you know, play itself out, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So you know, and in fact, uh, the APR has actually gone up a lot more. All right, but I'll explain why in a sec because this thing actually just suffered a kind of big dump. I actually bought the dip just now, so you know, not a whole lot, but definitely a. What I feel is a very small, it's an okay amount of money, but the potential will be pretty big, especially once, you know, because obviously this thing just went live. So also you'll notice that my camera's not on because it's hot in here. I don't want to turn on the lights and I don't want to put my shirt on. So that's why the camera is off. So I also need to make food. It's already 1.30 p.m. I, I still have to do my weightlifting exercise. I only got so many things to do, but luckily I'm coming to the home stretch of today. So today actually turned out to be a pretty good, pretty big uh, full day, full day's work for me. All right, it's still less hours than everyone else with well, a normal job, but you know, you know. So anyway, uh, Maker Pig Maker 2.0 is now out. So now it's called Maker and Maker Shares. All right, it's still 0.1 Phantom uh, pegged. Right, and I'm also in their Discord. So everyone, and I told everyone who I was in their Discord. I also uh, suggested, and everyone seems to 100% agree. So that's perfect. Uh, to not renounce everything so fast, right? We gotta make sure that this thing's working, so that we don't have to go through this, you know, crap again, right? You know, version three. All right, we never want to see a version three, okay? You know, uh, we're doing pretty well. So the airdrops have more or less been done, from what I can tell. Uh, so yeah, so you should have your tokens. Uh, obviously, I am still in Maker FTM, all right. And of course, you know that's that's just what I do nowadays. Let me see what Dow King said. Um, you work from home. Uh, yep, uh, yep, uh, yep. Of course, always work from home. Yeah, uh, wouldn't be a Opposed to having an office someday, but that's like way later. Okay. All right. Uh, okay. So, all right. So with that being said, the APRs are still kind of all over the place, uh, but they're actually still a ridiculous amount. So I don't even know what I'm going to wind up writing here. Okay. So for obvious reasons, there's no need for a Genesis pool because it's just you know uh, whatever. Okay, so this is what maker maker share LP. Oh man, which one is which again? This is maker share FTM. Oh, okay, I, ha I have this in reverse. Okay, so this is the base peg, this is the share LP, and this is the mix where you get the peg and the shares. Okay, got it. And there's your boardroom. which will be live. I thought it was supposed to be live later. Oh, okay. Well, I guess, uh, is there even anything staked in here? Uh, okay. Well, I guess the boardroom, I mean, I have to check their discord because they mentioned the boardroom. No, that's the old page maker. Mo says the maker, maker share is live. The UI is being fixed. Okay, so I guess the boardroom UI is also being fixed. So the developer Mo, I guess he's called MoPeg. I guess they're, that, that's their in-house developer too. Uh, or maybe, maybe he is from Fiverr and he just happens to be a personal interest in this project, which is great. So that counts as basically in-house. All right, so I guess their UI, I mean, they're obviously still getting everything up and running. So, yeah, but obviously people will find out what the boardroom is when it is. Actually, in fact, I'm going to actually include a link to the old farm pig maker. So if your tokens are still stuck in the old farm, you know, you'll just simply go to this site. Right, where you can access the old site and then pull your money out. So I don't know if this will still say zero or if my thing is not working right now or something zero I mean I think everybody are oh okay so people still have money stuck in here so whoever you are in the 68,479 you kind of need to I guess pull your money out uh, especially quickly because this thing is obviously going to be uh, the old peg 1.0 is going to be ab is abandoned so uh, oh well 
Anyway, or who knows? Maybe he's just going to leave this live and people could actually farm, like, basically the old tokens. But obviously I'm not doing that. I want the new stuff. All right, so you can see everything here. Uh, this is the farm. All right, so the smart APR system is still in play. Uh, this is a good time to really take a look real quick. Yes, there it is, because here's the base peg token LP. has more TVL, more daily APR compared to the share LP. Uh, even though the TVL is lower. So you know this is using smart APR. And of course the mix, which is peg and shares to put together LP, uh, also has, you know, uh, not a whole lot allocated, which is correct, all right? But it still also helps put buying pressure on the base peg token, which is maker. So perfect, perfect, perfect. So right now I'm going to write 104% to 100. Okay, so i got to write this down. Okay, peg maker 2 v 2.0, 104% to 150% uh, daily APR. Daily APR, because I'm going to close these out now. All right, and then I don't know what's up with the boardroom, uh, what the real number is, because obviously Mo is working on the UI and fixing everything as we speak. i got to include this link here. And again, there's just not much really to talk about, right? I mean, the pools are live 2.0. I bought this dip. It's already going back up. So whoever was stupid enough to dump everything, I mean, thanks for all the free to pig maker tokens because, you know, thanks, I guess. And it looks like the share price is actually doing all right, right? And Jay Crypto, the admin of peg maker, right, I guess the owner of the project, uh, he also did a pretty good job of making sure not to give everyone the airdrop tokens too quickly. So I'm, I'm kind of curious to see how this will all, you know, play out. So we'll, we'll see. But I'm, ha I'm happy that PegMaker is back. This thing was making a lot of effing money. And of course, the shares will always be worth something because we're still, even with that ginormous dump, like it was still above Peg, right? So, you know, again, because again, I personally want to see a Peg just be removed, right? So it'll always print, the boardroom will always print. There's really no, again, there's really no point in having a Peg, right? Because all it does, again, as I said in the last couple of videos, all it does is just screw up your project and like pull you down, right? Just but whatever. I mean, I'm happy. I'm big chilling. You know, we're gonna make a lot of money. Well, I'm gonna make a lot of money hopefully. And uh, yeah, you know, this thing is uh, live. I'll include the, the the new link over here and the new chart links. And then uh, that's not what you want to do. But you know, uh, I'm very happy. I'm very happy with my Maker FTM LP. It's back to business as usual for me. And again, I told the devs and everyone seems to be in agreement in the discord you know do not renounce right and they said they're going to totally go back to yield wolf so probably after uh, the devs make sure that everything is 100 percent working and then they have to renounce uh, at least the maker base peg token contract that's the condition for yield wolf so yeah so it's gonna be good again and of course when this is and the best part is when this goes laws on yield wolf oh that's gonna be great for me because that means I can stop manually doing everything and then just put it on Yield Wolf, right? Because, you know, I got to really simplify my things. I'm in like a million different things. So the more I can simplify, the easier it is for me. So, all right. So check it out. Do whatever you want, of course, as always. But you know me. I'm always in the base peg, F, uh, base, the, the base LP pool always. I don't do shares anymore. It's, it's just too much. But with the exception of basic black you know, or very special circumstances, I, I don't do shares anymore. Oh, look, look at that. The TVL is already climbing. Ah, oh, this is great. I wish I just had more money. I would just buy. I would literally just buy this all the way back up to sixty cents. And if some idiot dumps on me again, I would definitely buy a dip again. And like at some point, they just run out of stuff to dump with. You know, if I could have more of this, I would. But oh well, whatever. <sighs> okay, unless an emergency happens, I am totally done for today. I really think I'm going to take tomorrow off. No, I'm not because I got to do a Sphere Finance update and I got to do APYWeb3.com. And then, uh, I don't know, but it'll, it should be less work, so whatever. It's going to be a Saturday, so I should have a lot less heck. Because there's too much going on right now. So I just leave here and always take Saturday off. So I'll have time to catch up on everything. Because I haven't even had a chance to look at the geopolitical news stuff, right? I, I still got to catch up to that. So, all right. Enjoy uh, Peg Maker 2.0. Let's hope, uh, you know, this doesn't cuck us, right? 
And again, oh, I think I, I don't know if I remember to mention this, but I'll say it here. So the other reason why the dump sort of happened that you could see here is mostly because, well, obviously it just launched, right, or relaunched, I should say. But also everybody got airdropped their tokens. So obviously people who just want to leave the project just dumped all their tokens, like like total effing idiots. So, uh, all right, fine by me. I mean, you want to miss out on 100 to 160%. I think the realistic number should be around 30%. I mean, you literally don't want to walk away from free money. I mean, I'll take it all. You know, I'll, I'll buy it all if I could. In fact, if it's still pretty cheap later tonight when I do my DCA, yeah, I'll actually probably buy more of this. I really want to buy more Poseidon, but I'll buy more of this too. I gotta buy like 11 million things, man. I don't know. Maybe I'll have to pull money from Sphere to, you know, buy this up. So that I, I, I actually forget now that you know now because I'm because I've been in like trying to recover mode for so long that I almost forgot what it's like to actually have disposable income and money to actually really go ham on projects that I really like. So it's nice to get reacclimated with something like that, you know? So good, very good, very good, very good. And again, the simple fact that PegMaker at least seems to have an in-house developer, that's that's even better, man. So that, that, that works for me, that works for me. Enjoy the rest of your day or night. I'll probably see you all tomorrow. It'll be APY Web 3 and Sphere Finance update. Very, very excited. Especially because everyone keeps nagging me about Sphere updates. So I'll give you one. I, I think it's okay because even though nothing's really changed, it's gone up so much. So I guess we could talk a little more about it tomorrow. All right, thanks. And uh, time to actually make some food and lift weights. Oh, like, subscribe share the video, and of course you'll see my incredible face uh, tomorrow as well. Thanks. Well, unless tomorrow is also really hot, and then I'm going to have to turn on the air conditioner. Oh, okay, so you'll still see my face. I just have to do more weightlifting, of course.